He's a world-renowned artist collected by everyone from A-list celebrities to world leaders. Yes, his 3D art Super Bowl collection will be on display at the Super Bowl Experience and NFL Shop. Welcome to the show, Charles Fazzino. Great, thank you so much. I'm happy to be here. Yeah, we're very thrilled to have you. Well, we have to address this masterpiece <laughs> right in front of us. You've got to take us on a journey of, of how this came to be. This is an epic, epic piece of art. Well, I started working with the NFL 24 years ago, and every year I, I participate in the uh, Super Bowl, we show a whole collection of all my artwork. I'm a New York City artist, and I started painting the helmets that the NFL sent me many years ago, and they said, what could you do with these helmets? So I started painting, playing with them, and they really came together when I put my 3D style to it. That's the thing, yeah. I mean, you're, you're, you're renowned also, not just for your artwork, but your, your 3D artwork as well. So is that how this relationship with the NFL started? Did they, re they reached out to you with helmets and said, do your 3D thing with this? How did that all come about? <laughs> Years ago, uh, they asked me, uh, I should say, I approached them first and I wanted to uh, license the Jets because I'm from New York and the Giants. So they gave me the license for that. Then they saw what I was doing with it, doing this pop art style that I've been doing since the 80s. They loved it. They said, how about commemorating Super Bowl? And I was like, yeah, I think I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> sure, why not? Yeah. I got some time. So I started with you know, the helmets they sent me and then the 3D, uh, my 3D wall art that uh, everybody has been knowing since the 80s. They were limited edition, signed and numbered, uh, printed in my studio in New York. And then I have a whole team. We work together cutting and gluing everything by hand. Gosh, I mean, it's incredible. You know, tell us what people can experience when they go to see your artwork. Well, I have something for everybody. I have posters that we do for the NFL, you know, that's the official poster, signed or unsigned. Those are like 25 to $40. And then you have uh, pieces like, you know, that go up to seven, dollars $8,000, which are the hand-painted helmets. I have small helmets. I have mini prints that commemorate, you know, this year in Las Vegas Super Bowl. So I have something for everybody. The limited editions are the most popular, and then on them, what we do is we put the two teams and the winning score, if you want it, at the end when we ship them from New York oh, after the game. Oh, very cool. Yeah. It's not just the NFL that you're associated with, of course, although that's why you're here. I mean, you, you do everything from landscapes to, to, to New York pa paintings to, to animals, your cat paintings as well. I everything. love those. <laughs> uh, but you also have some very, you know, hugely world-famous names collectors. Do you have a particular favorite that you were like, oh my goodness, oh. that person has like one, two, three pieces of my art? Uh, so many people, I mean, especially in baseball and football and just celebrities like Lady Gaga's father uh, asked me to do some pieces when she was on the Super Bowl and he has them in his restaurant in New York. Also, Tom Brady's dad contacted us and said, I want something for Tom's birthday. Would you design a helmet, you know, with a happy birthday on it with all his, you know, achievements? Did that, so, you know, that and, you know, working on a commission right now for Anthony Scaramucci. Oh, nice. You know, so I'm, you know, many different people. I met with the Bidens, and I'm doing artwork for the White House. So this oh, wow. year, so I met with them, and that was an unbelievable experience for Toys for Tots, because I did the artwork for that. So you name it, I try it all. Now, the burning question I have <laughs> while I'm looking at this, I'm like, who gets first dibs on something <laughs> like this, this unique, this special? Yeah, well, it's... Um, you know, they're, they're for any of my collectors to collect. I try to make a lot of uh, different helmets and different themes. Of course, this year, you know, it's the Chiefs and the 49ers, so I have a whole array of different helmets and different themes that have to do with their team. But of course, the Super Bowl pieces appeal to everybody and, you know. Oh yeah. And they can see the whole collection at, um, like here in town, I'll be at an amazing art gallery with- uh, um, Jacoby Myers. Jacoby Myers, yeah. tomorrow night and that's at six o'clock, and then they could see the whole collection also at the NFL Experience. See, that was something else so I was great. gonna mention, because obviously you're at the NFL shop, you're at the NFL Experience, but you also have another exhibit here in Las Vegas right now with Jacoby from the Raiders. Yes, and they'll have, you were mentioning my other artwork, mm -hmm. so besides sports I do, you know, pieces on Vegas, because I've been coming for years and I love Las Vegas, I could paint it with my eyes closed. So, <laughs> um, and I have some really cool pieces on the strip that I've been doing for many years. This, awesome. is, this is amazing. Yeah. I'm like, I'm just in awe of this right here. I want to see the guys <laughs> in the game, not this art, but like wearing 3D <laughs> yeah. art on their head. That would be so an incredible cool. I would like that for the next Super Bowl. I'm right? going to bring that up to oh, them. No, you're right. <laughs> no, you're right. We'll see you on the sideline going, no, don't damage the helmet. That took me hours. Incredible yes. stuff. Really Thank incredible. you so much for stopping by this morning.
To learn more about Charles, head to Fazino.com. Make sure to check out his gallery. That is, the info is right there on your screen. I'm taking this. I'm just going to say, I'm I want to put it, it on. <laughs>